Hello! Welcome to Sistera. Thank you so much for tuning in today to watch a demo video of one of our application templates. Let's jump in. Today, we're going to go through a demo of our Carbon Accounting application template. Now, within sustainability and ESG as a whole, data tends to be siloed and disparate. And I've talked a lot about data being all over the place and manual many times, and it doesn't change here either. The big thing to focus on is specifically that external data. So as you dive into scope three and you're trying to see the impact of your value chain or your suppliers, that is where it's extremely challenging to gather the correct data accurately. This kind of ties to the next point here with inefficient static reporting around scope one, two, and three. Just like your sales information or your CRM information related to your customers, you wanna have 24 seven insight into every scope of carbon accounting. It's a living domain. It should not be limited to a one time a year reporting and it has a heartbeat. So how do you do that around data? And how do you do so in a way that'll demonstrate impact and be accessible all the time? Well, we've created this solution. Our carbon accounting template acts as a centralized data hub and a single source of truth. You can bring all of your internal data here and you can open it up to your suppliers as well. So suppliers or external bodies can either manually input their carbon data into their side of the application, or you can do direct API integrations into their systems if that's better. This creates a fast and easy online collection and sharing of data. And again, like all of our applications, this is built with the ability to rapidly adjust and change to fit those changing requirements that we're seeing so often within this domain. The next tile I'd like to dive into is carbon accounting. In the carbon accounting module, you're gonna see this main dashboard. Now you can customize this main dashboard either through your intake survey that you'll take the first time you visit the application or that you can retake anytime by selecting this button in the top right or if you come over to this navigation menu, if you select scope selection, you can choose any relevant scope one, two, and three emissions categories. This will then be reflected in that main dashboard. So for now, I'm gonna leave these as is. If I return to the dashboard and come to the bottom of the page, you're gonna see a row for each category that you selected in that scope selection. And now manual data in here is as easy as a few clicks and entering the metric tons of CO2 emission for that date. So say I wanted to input a data point for waste. If I click on this, I can simply type in a number here. If you don't know your calculated emissions, you can actually use one of our built-in calculators by selecting calculate. Now what's gonna show up here, our waste calculator that looks extremely familiar from our carbon calculators application. Again, what'll happen here is you can input all of the needed information, select your waste material, how you disposed of it, and then this will then be added to that chart on this page. Perhaps you want someone else to fill in data for any one of these categories. You can actually assign users to this category bar. I can come in here and click under assignee and select who is gonna be in charge of this. For this example, I'll select Luke. Now Luke will either get an email or some kind of push notification. And if Luke wants to log in, he can come in here and under tasks, users will then see any of their assignments in their filtered list under tasks. Now, perhaps some of the data you need is from an external source, such as a supplier. If you head over to our suppliers area, you can actually add suppliers to this module and request specific information from them and start the conversation to help you start aggregating your scope three emissions. This supplier portal will allow suppliers to input and share their data without accessing all of your organization's information. Again, this is a core building block. So depending on what you need or how deep you would like to go into scope three, this could be further customized and tailored to fit your needs. Last but not least, this entire module also allows for integrations with exposed O data or an API for importing bulk data to the carbon accounting module. All right, that concludes the demo of our carbon accounting template. 